the one heat and temperature are two quantities that are different from each other in some ways. However, it's a direct relationship between the two because I both quantities are measured in the same unit. I I the more heated an object is the higher the temperature the object will have. And I I I the impact of heat on a body is its temperature. So heat causes temperature. So looking through I is wrong, I is right. The more heated an object is the higher temperature, and the impact of heat is its temperature. So I I is also I I is also correct. So the answer to question one is B. Question two. The life cycle of the Anopheles mosquito is characterized by A. Incomplete metamorphosis. B. A long period of hibernation. C. Greater experience of aquatic environment. D. Continuous feeding on plants and organic matter. The answer to question 2 is C. 3. An example of the reduced principle in sustainable waste management is A. Recycling plastic bottles. B. Reusing usable water bottle. C. Dumping food scraps in the dustbin. And then D. Using paper towels instead of a hand dryer. The answer to question 3 is B. Reusing or using a reusable water bottle. Then question 4. The same amount of force is applied to three balls at the same time. The acceleration of the three balls is observed to be different from one another. This is because of the differences in A weight, B shape, C mass, B size. The answer to question 4 is C. Why? Why mass? Always depends on mass and an acceleration. So it's a mass. Question 5. In transmission and distribution of electricity, step down transformers are used to A. Ensure that electricity is distributed for consumption at safe voltage levels. B. Enhance efficient transmission over long distances without significant energy loss. C. Help reach every community at the lowest affordable level. D. Ensure that power disruption does not occur frequently. The answer to question 5 is A. Ensure that electricity is distributed for consumption at a safe voltage. Step down. Yes. Steps. Question 6. A green economy is an economy that aims for sustainable development without degrading the environment. This can be achieved through I. Minimizing the rate of infrastructural development, especially in urban areas. I, I enhance energy and resource efficiency. I, I, I ensuring reduced carbon emissions and pollution. Ivan prevention of the loss of biodiversity and ecosystem services. Question six. So, looking at the I, minimizing the rate of structural development, especially, well, it has nothing to do with the green economy. So. Enhance energy and resource efficiency. That's true. That's right. I, I, I. Ensuring reduced carbon emissions and pollution. That's also right. Prevention of loss of biodiversity. That's also right. So the answer to question 6 is B. Question 7. A track applies a force of 120 Newton. It's an acceleration of 1.5 meters per second squared. Find its mass. So... As I stated earlier, force equals mass times acceleration. So we are finding mass here of force is 120 Newton equals 1.5 M. So in order to make this out, you multiply um, 10 by both sides. So that this becomes 15. So multiply this by 10. 
multiply this by also 10. So you now have 1200 equals in M. So over 15, over 15. So 15 cancels 15. So 1200 divided by 15. So the answer is 80. 80 kilograms. So number 7 is A. Question 8. In a tag of war, the two sides each apply the force of 7500 newton. The net force is to each side coming with 7500 newton. 7500 from this side. 7500 also pulling from the other side. So the net force will be 0. Question 9. In all prokaryotic and eukaryotic cells, ah, okay, I presume this question wants to say um, in prokaryotic and eukaryotic cells, which of these organelles are present? So we have cell membrane mitochondria, cell wall, and the ribosomes. So, um, cell membrane is right, because you have cell membrane. You all have mitochondria as well. A cell wall. Some eukaryotic cells don't have cell wall. And then ribosomes. Ribosome is also right. So we have I, 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 and I. So question 9. The answer is B. This is a preamble. A pair of bar magnets are brought together such that the north poles are close to each other. Use the information to answer question 10 and 11. A pair of magnets will experience is not a knot, so they're not poles. So definitely it's a repulsion. So A. Question 11. The magnetic force experienced by the two bar magnets is because the poles are poles are alike. So question 11 is also A. Question 12. The non-feeding stage in the life cycle of mosquito is the we have lava pupa adult egg. It's a pupa. Question 13. The seed drill is a tool used on farms to A. Create deep furrows for planting. B. Remove rocks and debris from soil. C. Create rows for right seed depth. D. Compact soil for better drainage. The answer to question 13 is C. Create rows for right seed depth. Potential energy can be found in I, a ripe or poor hanging on a tree. I guess so. Yes. Water in a dam held at a height. That's also true. A bed perched on a tree branch. That's also right. So our answer to question 14 is D. 15. Which of the following is not one of the terrestrial planets? So, Mars, Mercury, Jupiter. So the answer to question 15 is D, Jupiter. Question 16. Climate change is characterized by I, decreasing global temperatures. No. Nope. Rise of sea level, yes. Changing rainfall patterns, that's also true. So, I, I, and I, I, I. So, the answer to question 16 is B. Question 17. An improper method of waste disposal is A. Open burning, B. Incineration, C. Reuse, D. E, chemical treatment. The answer to question 17 is A. Open burning. 18. Possible disadvantage of monoculture is A. Improved soil structure and fertility. B. Lower risk of crop failure. C. Reduced divesting crops. D. Lower water usage. The answer to question 18 is C. Reduced divesting crops. Question 19. Elements on the periodic table are arranged A. According to their sizes. B. In order of decreasing volume. C. In order of increasing atomic number, D, according to their colors. So question 19 is C. 
according to the atomic numbers. 20. The most abundant element in the solar system after hydrogen and helium is A. Oxygen, B. Carbon, C. Ion, D. Sodium. Answer that's question 20. Is A. Oxygen. Preamble. An element has two electrons in the core shell and three electrons in the valence shell of its atom. This is information to answer question 21 and 22. So this is what the question is saying. So this is a core with two electrons and then the valence electrons are three. So what's the atomic number? The atomic number is 5. So 21 is B. 22. The element with this atomic structure is um, hydrogen, helium, lithium, beryllium, boron. Boron is the fifth. So we see boron. 23. The part of the cell that holds DNA is the A chloroplast. B vacuum, C nucleus, B cytoplasm. The answer to question 23 is C nucleus. 24. The canine tooth is mainly used for A grinding, B crushing, C tearing, D chewing. The answer to question 24 is C tearing. 25. A capacitor releases its energy by A charging, B discharging, C burning, D producing light. And that's question 25 is B discharging. 26. The calcium ions contained in hard water A are good for strong bones and teeth. B make digestion of food difficult. C fastens the process of digestion. D causes heart ailment. And that's question 26 is A. 27. Using raised beds for planting helps to A. Reduce water logging. B. Provide aeration to the roots. C. Maintain moisture levels. B. Reduce the need for watering. The answer to question 27 is A. Reduce water logging. 28. Bacterial communicable diseases are usually treated with A. Vaccination. B. Antiviral medications. C. Antibiotics. D. Surgery. The answer to question 28 is C. Antibiotics. 29. A suitable machine for loading drums of palm oil onto a truck is A. A screw. B. A crowbar. C. A wheelbarrow. D. An inclined plane. The answer to question 29 is D. An inclined plane. Question 30. The light emitting diode is not found in A. Electronic indicators. B. Remote controls. C. Power generation. D. Making of signposts. Question 30. The answer is C. Power generation. Light emitting diode has no use in the generation of power. 31. The bacterium is a or an A. Eukaryotic cell, no. Prokaryotic cell, plant cell, no. Animal cell, no. So bacteria is a prokaryotic cell. So question 31 is B. Question 32. The nucleus of a living cell, I, contains DNA. That's true. Coordinates many cell processes. That's also true. III carries hereditary information. That's also true for a nucleus. IV carries out all chemical reactions. No, that's not true. So the answer to question 32 is D. I, 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 I. So that's it for question 32.
Question 33. A force of 20 newton is applied to an object of mass 5 kg. What is the acceleration? So again, force equals mass times acceleration. Your force is 20 newton. Your mass is 5, 5 kg. So put your A there. That will size by 5. So your acceleration is going to be 4 meters per second squared. That's question 33 is B. Question 34. The main goal of a green economy is to A. Industrialize. B. Reduce greenhouse gas emissions. C. Increase resource consumption. D. Reduce rural urban migration. The answer to question 34 is B. Reduce greenhouse gas emissions. 35. Raised seed beds are helpful because of I. Better drainage. I. I. Increased soil compaction. I. 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 Easier weed control. So question 35. I is true. Yes. Then for the I, I, I don't know how it benefits plant growth, but I, I, I is also true. So question 35, our answer is C. 36. Electricity is usually transmitted at low current, high voltage. B, high current, low voltage. C, low current, low voltage. D, high current, high voltage. Question 36. The answer is A. Low current, high voltage. 37. A crop usually grown on ridged seed beds is A. Wheat, B. Lettuce, C. Corn, D. Granite. Question 37. The answer is D. Granite. 38. The primary goal of sustainable waste management is to A. Maximize landfill space B. Minimize waste generation C. Increase waste incineration D. Encourage littering The answer to question 38 is B. Minimize waste generation 39. A livestock farmer is to formulate feed for the animals being red. Which of the following factors should be considered? I. Specific dietary needs of animals. I. I. Animal species and age. I. 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 Factitiveness of feed. I. Mean, the health condition of the animals. So, specific dietary needs is there. This livestock farm, animal species, and age. The species also matters. Attractiveness of feed. Animals will eat whatever I give to them that is edible. And then, Ivan, health condition of the animal. That's also true. So, the answer to question 39 is B. 40. And increase the strength of the magnetic force between two magnets by A. Decreasing their sizes. B. Increasing their distance. C. Flipping their poles. D. Bringing them close together. The answer to question 40 is D.